Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Tor. Um, this is my very first video. Um, and I wanted to make my YouTube channel. Um, since it's coronavirus quarantine right now, I thought what better time, since I have so much time now, and I can start making videos. So, a little bit about what this channel is going to be. Um, I love luxury fashion, designer fashion, fashion in general, and I really want to share that with the community that is already on YouTube. I am an avid watcher of luxury unboxing videos, luxury haul videos, luxury wishlist videos, luxury collection videos, like all of the above, and I wanted to sort of join the community. So um, this video is going to be fairly short. Um, it's going to be my five favorite luxury purchases. Um, I'm going to divvy them up into different categories and let's get going. So the first category is ready to wear. My first piece and my favorite piece is this Prada shirt. This is from the women's collection. It is sort of, it came about when they were doing um, their more archive reissue, um, which is very popular right now. I bought this in December of last year, I believe, so December 2019. It is from the women's collection. Um, it has this half Hawaiian girl print on this side as well as roses on this side. It's very gothic, but like very fun. And it has the big Prada um, logo right here. I originally bought this because I have the shorts in this print and I got them in the men's collection. So when I saw this, I was like, you're coming home with me. Um, I often buy from the women's collection because the cuts are shorter. Um, and since I have a fairly short torso because I am shorter, I find they fit me more proportionally than if I shop from the men's collection. Um, I do have a love-hate relationship with Ready to Wear. Um, the prices are often very high and the quality is often the same as you would get from any store. Um, it's just often the prints are nicer. The, the attention to detail is there um, and the colors are often a little bit more vibrant, but at the end of the day, it's just a piece of fabric. Um, my next piece is going to be shoes. So these shoes are my Celine loafers. These are new season. Um, I got them in February as my new work shoe as I was starting a new job. Um, and I wanted something that could be sort of casual, but also fairly dressed up if it needs to be. Sorry, I have something in my eye. These are a blue calfskin um, base with a white um, toe front and a hunter green sort of, um, I don't even know what this is called, but you know, detail. Um, they are leather bottom and they've been fairly well worn. Oh, I'm so sad that it's quarantine because I can't wear these anymore. Now that I'm working from home, maybe I can sort of wear them around the house while I sit in my sweatpants, but they're so cute. My next piece is going to be a hat. Um, so this is my James Jean X Prada um, collaboration hat. It's from the 2018 resort, I believe. I wanted to get the sweater in this colorway, so like the gray and the pink bunnies. Um, this hat is um, fully cashmere, so it's very, very soft, very warm. Um, I don't really like wearing hats, to be honest, but I make an exception for this one. It's just so cute. My next one is small leather goods or sort of wallet type accessories. For that, we have this Prada heat map pouch. This I bought um, December 2017. Um, I bought it a part of their sale. I love when Prada does sales because you can often find like almost the whole collection on sale. So it's full nylon and it has the heat map on both sides and this Safiano leather um, tab. I got this little shark from Coach when I was visiting Las Vegas with my mom, so cute. And on the inside is this black nylon. This thing is a workhorse of an item. It sort of acts as my wallet. Um, I just throw everything in here, my cards, my key case, um, my little card holder, and sort of any money and coins, it just all goes in this. And it's super like user-friendly, super resilient. Like I've had it for over, three years now and it's still like, still looks brand new. And then um, my last piece is my favorite bag. So 
you can see a theme here. Prada is my favorite brand, so obviously my favorite bag is this Prada bag. Um, it's this full nylon crossbody. Um, it has three compartments. I believe it's called like the Prada Messenger. I'm not totally sure. It's a part of their permanent collection, so you can find it every season. It has sort of one compartment here, a bigger middle compartment with has a pocket on the inside, and a compartment on the back. I often use this compartment to sort of put my metro card um, and then keys and then wallet and more like delicate goods on the inside. Um, it's super good, super user friendly. I love it. Great quality. Um, the fact that it's full nylon is really good for Vancouver because if it gets like wet and rainy, which it often does here, I can keep my umbrella in here and then also just wipe off the water whenever it comes. So you can adjust it in two places here and here and it's just it's so comfortable and it's so easy to use it matches everything and it's just a great bag honestly so that is all i have for my first video um thank you for watching i really appreciate any sort of viewership i can get um i look forward to doing my next video and if you're sort of interested in this content, definitely feel free to subscribe and give this video a like. I'm not totally sure how YouTube analytics work, but um, any sort of critique that people have, please be nice about it and let me know for my next video. Um, I look forward to seeing you all again. And yeah, well, thank you.